Mike for Wine Weirdos. Carlos here. Let's check out the 2014 Cote de Crows from Morgan. This is out of Monterey. This wine's coming in at 14.2% alcohol and $18 a bottle. Mostly equal parts Grenache and Syrah. Mm -hmm. It's really high production for Wine Weirdos. 6,500 cases. It's beautiful in the glass though, like a neon purple. Yeah, a neon purple. Yep, on the Pretty nose. Dark. This is what I'm looking for in Syrah and Grenache. This is similar to what I get out of Santa Barbara County when they're doing their GSM blends. Really nice sort of a kirsch-like and candied fruit, some strawberries, mm -hmm. and really not much else. Pretty primary. What's it doing on the palate? On the palate, there is a whole lot of fruit. Mm. I'm getting a whole lot more, though, of the darker fruits. Blackberries and mm -hmm. and ripe blueberries. Yep. It is a little bit tart, and that's kind of it works well with the oak on this uh, this wine. But again, like you said, it does remind me of uh, Santa Rita Hills GSMs, Paso GSMs. Yep, I like this uh -huh. a lot. I like it 10%, 12% uh, new French oak, 10 months, and I like that treatment. I think it's coming across as a very linear, very clean wine. Mm -hmm. I think at $18, you'll probably see it show up by the glass at a lot of restaurants. I could see that, definitely. And I think it's a good food wine. Mm -hmm. I'd buy it. <laughs> Very versatile. Cool stuff from Morgan good there. Stuff. Cote de Crows 2014. We'll be back with more on Wine Weirdos. Cheers. Cheers.